Hey guys, it's the Redstone Wizard here again, bringing you more information on villagers and their detection ranges on this one. So let's get started. We have here one villager. Now, villager can, this is the range that if he is not in a village can detect from the north west corner which is right here you can take 16 blocks that way 16 blocks that way 16 that way and that way with this block being one so it is right literally right there then they can detect one oh, one block above their head and a few blocks below their feet but i actually mentioned this in another video but yeah that's where they can detect if you only have one villager and it's the head of the bed not the foot so let's just get rid of this guy yeah okay but now you see this big box this big box is the range that if i had a bed with a villager locked in here and another uh, and another bed this represents the center of the village you can uh, a villager entering in this big box will be able to detect the bed the workstation within the range of this they don't have to be within this little small box so if I set the set up or the centers here with a villager, he creates a village and this becomes the detection range. It is 95 blocks from the center. And that is if you're not removing a villager from here because it's actually 101 blocks before they forget, before they're able to detect another part so it's a uh, bigger range but this is you're bringing a villager into a system and that villager is not associated with a village so we come all the way over here we bring a villager in and as soon as he crosses this line right here this line is 95 blocks from that diamond block right there he will be able to detect that, oh, there's a village here. Oh, they have beds. Okay, I am now part of this village. And if you go five more blocks out this way, five more blocks out, that's 100, they will, uh, they will still detect the village. But then you, move a hundred, uh, then you move it to 101 blocks away and you have a bed outside of the range they'll be like oh i'm no longer part of that village i'm going to start a new village out here so you can have overlapping villages but as soon as you move a villager within this range and as soon as they get close enough to the center of one the, the villages will just that one village will go away he'll jump onto the other village so it gets a little confusing but yeah it's but more than the ranges from the center of the village it is 95 blocks in all directions and 75 blocks vertically uh, going up and down so you get this huge area the village this is as big as the village uh, once you have a village you bring a villager into this range you will have another villager to this village if there's enough beds because beds determine the village not doors like in the previous ones so I'm still seeing if there's other ways that I can maximize the um, huh, maximize the way that certain things get done but i hope this information was useful to you guys 
and helps improve your trading halls, your breeders, your iron farms, your fully automatic crop farms. But, you guys, this is the Redstone Wizard. Enjoy building.